Welcome to, As Above, So Below, Ancient Wisdom for a Better Life. In this captivating exploration, we delve into the profound principles of metaphysics and ancient wisdom that have echoed through the ages. In the realm of metaphysics, the principle of correspondence serves as a guiding light. It reveals the deep connection between the microcosm, which represents the individual, and the vast macrocosm, symbolizing the universe itself. It's like finding a mirror that reflects the wonders of the cosmos within each one of us. The understanding of this interplay is pivotal to unlocking the secrets of a better life. Imagine a tapestry, where every thread is intricately woven into the fabric of existence. The principle of correspondence tells us that what happens within us echoes in the world around us, and vice versa. By exploring this interconnectedness, we can harness the power of the law of attraction, another pivotal aspect of ancient wisdom. Like attracts like, and the energy we emit draws similar energies from the universe. Imagine standing at the edge of a serene pond, casting ripples with every thought, emotion, and action. These ripples extend far and wide, influencing the events and experiences that flow back to us. In the vast and infinite tapestry of existence, there exists a profound journey of self-discovery, the exploration of the microcosm, the essence of who we truly are. In this inner realm lies the core of our being, an intricate network of thoughts, emotions, and the mysterious workings of our bodies. Our thoughts, like the gentle whispers of the wind, hold the power to shape our reality. They can either lift us to soaring heights or drag us into the depths of despair. Emotions, like the tides of the ocean, ebb and flow, influencing our perceptions and actions in ways both subtle and profound. And within the labyrinthine systems of our bodies, every heartbeat, every breath, and every cell dances in harmony, orchestrating the symphony of life. As we delve deeper into the microcosm, we begin to grasp the immense potential that lies within us. The power of our thoughts and beliefs becomes apparent, as they pave the path to our dreams and desires. We come to understand that our inner realm is not a passive bystander, but an active architect of our reality. But the journey does not end here. Our quest takes us further, into the vast reaches of the macrocosm, where the grand panorama of the universe unfolds, revealing the interconnectedness of all things. Here, we witness the boundless realms of energy and consciousness, shimmering like stars in the night sky. The universe, an immense cosmic symphony, plays its melody, affecting every aspect of our lives. We acknowledge that we are not isolated beings but interconnected threads woven into the cosmic fabric of existence. The influence of the universe upon us becomes evident, as celestial bodies dance in celestial choreography, affecting the tides of our emotions and the rhythms of our lives. We embrace the cosmic dance, recognizing that we are both the dancers and the dance itself. As we stand in awe of this grand spectacle, we also discover a profound reflection of our own being within the vastness of the universe. We realize that we are not separate from the cosmos, we are part of it. The microcosm within us mirrors the macrocosm that surrounds us. In this intertwining of the inner and the outer, we come to understand the beauty of existence. The microcosm and the macrocosm are not isolated realms but interconnected facets of a greater whole. Through this journey of self-discovery and cosmic exploration, we find our place within the magnificent tapestry of life. In the grand scheme of things, we come to the realization that there exists an intriguing interplay between two realms, as above, so below. Imagine this principle as a cosmic law of attraction, where the thoughts and energy we emit into the universe are mirrored back to us in our reality. Just like a magnet drawing in its matching counterpart, our beliefs and intentions resonate with the vibrations of the universe, shaping the events and circumstances we experience. Yet, this interplay goes far deeper than mere surface-level desires and materialistic pursuits. It delves into the very core of our being, urging us to look beyond the superficial and explore the essence of our existence. 
Consider this example, suppose we continuously harbor negative thoughts and doubts within ourselves, doubting our abilities and feeling unworthy of success. These vibrations will reverberate into the universe, aligning with similar frequencies, and attract circumstances that reaffirm these negative beliefs. On the contrary, let's imagine a different scenario, suppose we cultivate a mindset of positivity, self-belief, and gratitude. These higher vibrations will resonate with the universe, drawing in opportunities and experiences that reflect these empowering beliefs. This profound interconnection of our thoughts, beliefs, and actions is like a symphony of life. Our thoughts are the conductor, guiding the orchestra of our beliefs, and our beliefs shape the melodies of our actions. When harmony prevails within us, our actions become purposeful, leading us toward growth and fulfillment. Thus, as above, so below, teaches us that our inner realm mirrors the outer reality, and vice versa. It urges us to become conscious co-creators of our destiny, aligning our thoughts, beliefs, and actions to manifest the life we desire. In the vast canvas of existence, a fascinating revelation awaits us, the fractal nature of reality. It unveils the repetitive patterns that dance across different scales, spanning from the tiniest particles to the grandest cosmic structures. As we observe the intricate patterns in nature, we find the mesmerizing recurrence of fractals. A snowflake's delicate symmetry mirrors the majestic branches of a towering tree. The veins on a leaf echo the tributaries of a mighty river. And the spiral galaxies in the cosmos reflect the swirling patterns of seashells on distant shores. The mirrored structures don't stop there. The universe reveals its grand design through fractals as well. Just as planets orbit around stars, moons dance around planets, and galaxies gravitate towards superclusters. This cosmic dance of repetition echoes the patterns found in every living being, from the smallest cell to the most complex organism. At every scale, we witness the echo of the same design, unveiling the intrinsic unity that weaves everything together. The interconnectedness underlying all things becomes apparent, and we begin to see that the very fabric of reality is an interwoven tapestry. Consider the profound unity expressed by the golden ratio, appearing in the spiral patterns of sunflowers, hurricanes, and galaxies alike. It's as if there's a hidden language, a universal code that connects all aspects of creation. In this fractal symphony, we become aware that each part reflects the whole, and the whole reflects each part. There's a harmonious dance between the microcosm and the macrocosm, where every action resonates across the cosmic stage. The fractal nature of reality beckons us to embrace the awe-inspiring interconnectedness of existence. As we recognize the mirrored patterns at various scales, we come to appreciate that we are not separate from the universe, we are an integral part of it. In the tapestry of existence, another captivating symbol emerges, the Ouroboros, an ancient depiction of a serpent or dragon devouring its own tail, forming an eternal loop. This timeless symbol encapsulates profound truths about the cyclical nature of life, beginnings, and endings. As we contemplate the Ouroboros, we come to grasp the cyclical rhythm that governs life. Just as the sun rises and sets, the seasons change, and day follows night, life unfolds in cycles of creation and dissolution. Endings are intertwined with new beginnings, and from every closure arises a fresh start. Embracing the idea of the Ouroboros, we find ourselves in a perpetual state of transformation. Just as the serpent sheds its skin, we too shed the layers of our old selves, continuously evolving and growing. In this eternal dance of change, we become conscious of our interconnectedness with the world around us. The Ouroboros teaches us that we are not isolated beings, but rather, we are threads woven into the cosmic fabric of existence. Just as the serpent remains connected to itself through the eternal loop, we are interconnected with the universe. Our actions, thoughts, and beliefs resonate beyond ourselves, affecting the vast web of life. Contemplating the eternal loop of creation, 
we realize that the cycle of birth, growth, decay, and renewal is a reflection of our own existence. Each phase holds its own significance, contributing to the symphony of life. The Ouroboros urges us to embrace all stages of our journey, for every experience is a stepping stone in the eternal evolution of our soul. In this light, the fractal nature of reality and the symbolism of the Ouroboros intertwine. The repetitive patterns across scales mirror the cyclical rhythms of the serpent devouring its tail. The interconnectedness underlying all things is reflected in the eternal dance of creation, where beginnings and endings are part of the same continuum. Together, the fractal patterns and the Ouroboros symbolize the ever-unfolding story of existence. They remind us to look beyond the surface, to see the deeper truths that connect us to the universe. As we embrace the cyclical nature of life, the transformative power of the Ouroboros, and the interconnectedness of all things, we embark on a profound journey of self-discovery and cosmic exploration. As we walk this path of self-awareness, we realize that our external world is a reflection of our inner landscape. The thoughts we harbor, whether positive or negative, find their way back to us, materializing in our experiences. When we radiate positivity and kindness, the world responds in kind, showering us with warmth and love. Conversely, when we dwell in negativity, the world reflects back our inner turmoil, presenting challenges to overcome. With this newfound understanding, we learn to accept challenges and difficult aspects of life as catalysts for growth. Rather than shying away from adversity, we face it head-on, knowing that it holds valuable lessons for our personal evolution. Embracing these challenges empowers us to transform and evolve, reaching new heights of self-awareness and strength. By recognizing the correspondence in daily life, we shift from a mindset of victimhood to one of empowerment. We acknowledge that we hold the creative power to shape our reality through our thoughts, emotions, and choices. We take responsibility for our experiences, understanding that we are not mere spectators but active participants in the unfolding drama of life. This shift in perspective empowers us to take charge of our reality, steering the course of our journey with intention and purpose. As we navigate life's twists and turns, we learn to harness our creative power, weaving the threads of our dreams into the fabric of existence. In this dance of correspondence, we become co-creators of our destiny. We find strength in accepting the interconnectedness between our inner world and the outer world, embracing the profound unity of existence. Through this recognition, we gain insight into the underlying harmony that governs life. So, let us walk the path of self-awareness, recognizing the correspondence in our daily lives. Let us accept challenges as stepping stones for growth and transformation. And let us shift from victimhood to empowerment, acknowledging our creative power to shape the reality we wish to experience. In the grand exploration of existence, we embark on a transformative journey, the journey of transformation. This path leads us to the depths of the unconscious mind, unveiling its significance in shaping our adult lives. As we delve into the labyrinth of our past, we come to recognize the profound impact of childhood experiences. The seeds of our beliefs, behaviors, and emotions are sown in those formative years, subtly shaping the very foundation of our adulthood. Through this realization, we gain insight into the intricacies of our present selves, understanding the roots from which our thoughts and actions grow. The unconscious mind, like a hidden force beneath the surface, influences our perceptions and behaviors in ways beyond our conscious awareness. It is the repository of our deepest desires, fears, and unresolved emotions. It paints the lens through which we view the world, coloring our experiences with patterns from our past. In the wondrous tapestry of existence, we reach a pivotal stage of our journey, the nurturing of the inner child. Here, we embark on a profound quest to provide love and nurturing, liberating ourselves from limiting beliefs that shape our reality. We begin by addressing unmet needs and suppressed emotions from the past. 
Like seeds buried in the soil, these unhealed wounds silently influence our lives, often leading us to repeat patterns and behaviors without conscious awareness. By shining a light on these buried emotions, we free ourselves from their hold, granting ourselves the love and care we may have longed for. Recognizing and releasing limiting beliefs is the next step in our journey. Like invisible chains, these beliefs confine us, shaping our thoughts and actions. We uncover the shackles that hold us back, acknowledging that we have the power to release ourselves from their grip. With every belief set free, we open the door to infinite possibilities and new realities. Through this process, we discover the profound power of self-compassion and self-nurturing. Just as a tender gardener lovingly tends to her plants, we learn to shower ourselves with kindness and care. With every act of self-love, we mend the wounded parts of our soul, cultivating a flourishing inner garden of peace and growth. As we journey onward, we draw closer to the principle of correspondence, understanding its profound teachings. We grasp the interconnected nature of reality, where every thought, emotion, and action echoes throughout the cosmic web. The ripple of our intentions finds its way back to us, creating the reality we consciously or unconsciously design.